Hey, it's Matt here for Newshooter.com at Interview 2019 and with Johnny from FX Line. Now you've got a bunch of new accessories for the uh, Nano series, um, battery plates mainly and a, and a very cool quad battery charger that's very small. Yes, absolutely. Our customer uh, asking uh, many, many uh, new accessories and uh, we get the, the new uh, four, for four nano uh, battery, uh, the charger. Very small uh, mini 2 ampere charger. You can charge uh, four battery at the same time. Very small, very compact. So when uh, you are using the the, the uh, when you are using the nano, easy to recharge four battery at the same time. And what's the sort of charge time to charge four batteries? Yeah, the charging time for four batteries about uh, one uh, one hour or something like this. Yes. And it's very lightweight, so very good for people who are travelling, um, just want to put it in their bag or they're, they're going out for a shoot on the day and they want to charge some batteries while they're shooting. It's a very small, compact uh, product. Yes. And uh, the size for the charger is so small that uh, you can put in any uh, camera case or uh, carry very more easily as a big uh, charger, yes. And what else have you got to show us? Uh, we have uh, now uh, two new uh, plates. So... We have a two plate for NPF uh, battery, and uh, we find out at the market that uh, some NPF um, and uh, some uh, accessory like uh, monitor or um, uh, data transmission uh, uh, for video data and, and stuff like this are using sometimes two different systems. Most of the professional monitors are using uh, in a voltage range for uh, 11 volt to uh, 16 or 24. And uh, we make an adapter uh, that you put the, the battery, the nano battery on it, and uh, you get on the NPF adapter 14.8 uh, volt. So we have a label on the, on the battery to show exactly this. So these these are actually be perfect for something like a, like an Atomos Ninja Five or any type of monitor where that would normally take a Sony NP style battery. You can run it with a longer V lock battery and then get the benefits of having an added D tap as well to power another accessory, say a wireless transmitter. Exactly, but in the other side, we get the components monitor made in China. We are using only 7.4 volts, so we make an adapter. So you have a v -log battery, 14.8 volt. You get an output on the D-tap for 14.8, and on the NPF adapter, you get an output for 7.4. So again, this is a little Swiss knife. You get 7.4 and 14.8 on v -log and uh, D-tap. So very easy to use, two adapters, two different use. And uh, you've got two other um, plates here as well. Yes, we have uh, uh, the plate is uh, uh, to use on the road, 15 millimeter road. The plate is already uh, done, and uh, you have uh, you can slide on any uh, 15 millimeter road. Yes, and you got this tiny little one too. Yes, this tiny is that uh, some uh, photo camera uh, are using some uh, small little cage, and sometimes the the adapter is too big for this, so we do a small little tiny uh, place that you can use the battery directly. You have, you have no, uh, no um, V-Lock adapter, but you can get the, the power directly from the USB, uh, C, the US, uh, mini USB and USB, and uh, the D-Tap. So very small that you can put on any place on a small camera cage. Now in terms of availability and pricing, the, the quad charger here, when's that going to be available and how much? Yeah, the price is not uh, really calculated. Uh, it could be something around 245 uh, US dollar retail price on the market. And the additional plates and the power? Additional plate, uh, the, the plates are already available on the market. We are, um, all our agents have uh, this plate already, yes. And the Sony NP battery plate to uh, v -Lock? It's already, it's already uh, yes, available, yes. Thanks very much. You're welcome. Thank you very much.